Hi, this is a video to show you a quick fix for the flappy door animations inside of the Game Maker. Let me show you an example. If you've made a custom door inside of VoxEdit and uploaded it to your library, you'll see doors opening and closing with this sort of animation. And when you hop into the game itself, you'll see that the doors do that. And that's not what we want. Um, there is a workaround for this one. So what I'd like to do is to show you that. We'll go ahead and we'll put the door behavior on them. And we can have interact as your message or a message of your choice. That's fine. We're going to change trigger to any dot reset or anything you like. But this is the purpose for resetting that animation. We're going to go ahead and edit the logic and we're going to change the starting state from close to open. So the door will be open when the game begins. Next, we're going to place a numpad next to the avatar portal. We're going to go ahead and make it invisible and no collisions. We're going to add a speaker component to it. Um, that's up to you. I'll use multiplayer in this example. We'll go ahead and we will remove a uh, look at target. We don't want to show any text. Uh, we want to detect the avatar. Uh, we don't need it to be that big. Just make sure that the avatar portal is inside of it. The message to send will be the animation reset. So any reset. And we want to only send this once. So as soon as the game begins, the speaker will detect the avatar and go ahead and close those doors. You can see it started the uh, door as open and then a message got sent and closed the door. And now all these doors are interact or interactable like, like normal. And you can put that on all your doors so they don't do that flappy animation anymore. Hope that's been useful. Have a great day.